Today we are going to round 85 to the nearest 10. If you look on this number right, in between 80 and 90, there is 85. Since it's in between, you round up to 90. Or we could do it with numbers. Underline the tenth place and draw an arrow to your neighbor. And... Is the name next door is five or more round up? Round up! Round up to 90. Today we're going to round to the nearest hundred using the number 371. On the number line, I 371 is right about here. So, it's a lot closer to 400, so I'd do 400 if you ask me. Underline the hundred and go to your neighbor, the tens, and... If your neighbor next door is five or more, round up. Round up. So seven is more than five, so you round up. We're going to round to the nearest thousand. Our number today is 3,297. Two, 3,297 is about right there. So we'll round us down to 3,000. Now let's do it with numbers. Now, as you see, 3,297 is between 3,000 and 4,000. So first you have to underline your th the thousands place. Then draw an arrow to your neighbor, the hundreds place. And sing. If the name of that star is five or more, round up. Now it, but it's lower than five, so it has to round down to three thousand. Sometimes rounding can be tricky. For example, here's a four-digit number. Three thousand seven hundred twenty-one. And we're going to round it to the nearest hundred. Mm -hmm. Since we're rounding to the nearest hundred, let's underline our hundred and think about it. Pretend like there isn't a thousand. Pretend it's just 721. What two hundreds is that between? 700 and 800. Now it really is a four digit number. So what two hundreds is it between? 3,700 and 3,800. So let's see which one it rounds to. We've underlined the hundred. Let's check the neighbor. If Your the neighbor next door is a five or more, round up. Round up. So tell us about the neighbor. The neighbor is only a two, which is less than five. So, so this round number rounds down to three hundred, three thousand seven hundred. Well done. If your neighbor next door is five or more, round up. Round up.